Can I get insurance on other people? My name is Darius. And I'm Carmen. And we're the founders of Wealth Nation. We teach go-getters and entrepreneurs how to own their own lifestyle through the infinite banking concept. So make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the notification bell so that you can be notified every single time we come out with videos just like this one. So we get this question a lot and we want to make sure that we answer it to give you all of the facts. So the fact of the matter is, yes, you can insure other people. You just need to prove that you have something called insurable interest. Mm -hmm. And what insurable interest is, is the fact that you have to be at financial hardship should somebody else pass. Exactly. Or you have to be financially responsible for individuals such as your children mm -hmm. or people that you're taking care of in your household. Exactly. So to give you an example, my mom has policies on myself and my brothers and we can insure her. Um, we keep it within the family, but if we wanted to go outside of the family, again, we just have to make sure that we have insurable interest. So for example, business partners, if mm -hmm. something were to happen to your business partner, you would definitely be at financial hardship. So you're able to in insure people like your business partners, for example. Exactly, because if something was to happen to your business partner or uh, uh, an executive in your business, then you have to figure out how in the world you're going to replace that income and you have to spend time in hiring someone else. So that sounds like definitely a, a hardship. Mm -hmm. So you are able to get insurance policies on other people. So one thing I want to add, when we say you can insure other people, we don't want you to go into an insuring frenzy and start insuring a lot of people. Mm -hmm. The point of the matter is just to let you know that you have the ability to insure other people if you have insurable interest. But we always need to make sure that you first have insurance on yourself before you start thinking about other people. And especially when it comes to the family situation, there's a hierarchy system that has to go in place. Mm -hmm. So the parents always have to have insurance before the children mm -hmm. and so on and so forth, grandparents and all of that. So you need to make sure that everyone in the family as far as the lineage is covered before you try to get to the next generation. And the reason why you may think about insuring family members is because you wanna keep the money inside the family. And when utilizing the infinite banking concept, what you're doing is you're borrowing from your insurance policy to buy things that you would normally purchase through the bank. And when it comes to things like cars or homes, if you can finance that through your family and pay the interest back to your family banking system, then that money stays within the family, mm -hmm. which is exactly why Carmen mother has insurance policies on her brothers and herself. So all the wealth can stay within the family. Mm -hmm. Very good point. I'm glad that you addressed that point because a lot of people would say, why would I insure my children? Why do I need to insure the grandchildren? And again, the point is legacy. Mm -hmm. We're making sure that everybody was, is covered because we can't ever predict when we pass, but to make sure that we're responsible in one, having that life insurance, and then two, coming together as a family and responsibly using the cash value to make more money. Mm -hmm. When it comes to creating a family banking system, kind of like the one Carmen and I share with you about what we're doing within our family, a good source to really get a good understanding of this is What Would the Rockefellers Do by Garrett Gunderson. This is a really good book that breaks down exactly how the policies are being utilized within the family and the reason why you want to have policies on your other family members. Mm -hmm. And we're really happy to share this information with you just because, like we said, there's a system and a process that goes in place. You're not just going to insure people for the sake of insuring them. We mm -hmm. have to be strategic in how this happens. So if you have any other questions, feel free to reach out to us, comment below, and also we'll have the link to this book in the comments below as well. And be sure to reach out to us on Facebook and Instagram at wealthnation.io. Remember to own your own lifestyle or someone else will.